Welterweight champion Kamara Usman defends his title against Colby Covington in the main event of UFC 268 live from Madison Square Garden. Let's break it down. Colby Covington's 33 years old. He's 5'11 with a 72-inch reach and a record of 16-2 with four knockouts and four submissions. From Clovis, California, Covington moved to Oregon when he was eight and took up wrestling in high school, lettering all four years to winning the state championship in his senior year. He went on to wrestle at Iowa State Community College, where he was a roommate of John Jones before transferring back to Oregon and becoming a two-time Pac-10 Conference champion at 174 pounds. After graduating with a degree in sociology, he made his pro debut in 2012 with a first-round TKO. He won his next four with two submissions before making his UFC debut with a first-round knockout over Wang Anying. In December of 2015, he suffered his first loss, a guillotine choke, to Worley Alves. He bounced back six months later with a rear naked choke of Jonathan Munier and then followed that up with a third round knockout of Max Griffin. He followed that up with decisions over Brian Barbarena and Dong Hyun Kim. And in the last fight of his contract, he defeated the always dangerous Damian Maia by unanimous decision. Seven months later, he defeated Rafael Dos Anjos to win the interim welterweight championship, but was subsequently stripped of his title when a surgery prevented him from taking on Tyron Woodley in a unification match. He returned in August of 2019, overwhelming former champion Robbie Lawler, throwing 541 strikes and attempting 18 takedowns en route to a lopsided unanimous decision to earn another title shot. On December 14, 2019, he challenged welterweight champion Kamara Usman, engaging in a savage back-and-forth war of attrition with both men absorbing punishment and Covington fighting with a broken jaw before getting dropped twice in the final minute of the fight and having the referee call a halt to the action. In September of 2020, he took on former champion and training partner Tyron Woodley, dominating the first four rounds before the fight was stopped in the fifth with Woodley complaining of a rib injury. A highly aggressive pressure fighter, Covington possesses an iron jaw with a solid stand-up game, world-class wrestling skills, and some of the best cardio in the sport, setting a breakneck pace and overwhelming his opponents with volume. Kamara Usman is 34 years old. He's six foot tall with a 76-inch reach and a record of 19-1 with nine knockouts. Born in Nigeria, he moved to Arlington, Texas at eight years old and started wrestling in high school, finishing with a 53-3 record. He wrestled Division II at the University of Nebraska, finished with a record of 44-1, then became a resident of the U.S. Olympic Training Center, but didn't make the 2012 team due to injuries. He turned pro in 2015 and went 5-1 and, and then joined the Ultimate Fighter, winning in the finale against Hader Hassan, getting a six-figure contract and following that up with a win over Leon Edwards. He racked up decision victories over Sean Strickland, Damian Maia, Rafael Dos Anjos, as well as a knockout over Sergio Marias before winning the World to Weight title with a one-sided domination of champion Tyron Woodley. In his first defense, he took on rival Colby Covington, and despite the fact that both men are known primarily for their wrestling, they engaged in a back-and-forth slugfest until Covington suffered a broken jaw and was stopped in the final minute of that fight. In July of 2020, he was supposed to fight longtime friend and training partner Gilbert Burns, at which point Usman left Sanford MMA, choosing to train in Colorado under Trevor Whitman. Nine days before the fight, Burns pulled out due to COVID-19, and Jorge Masvidal was brought in on six days' notice, losing via unanimous decision. In February of 2021, he surpassed Georges St. Pierre for longest winning streak at welterweight, when after getting dropped early, he gradually broke down Burns, dropping him with a jab and stopping him with a vicious ground and pound. On April 24, 2021, he made his fourth title defense with a dominant victory over Jorge Masvidal, decisively ending their rivalry with an explosive one-punch knockout. One of the most dominant champions in this sport, Marty is an excellent striker with decent power who uses a solid jab to set up his power shots and uses leg and stomach kicks to wear down his opponents in control distance and is one of the most accomplished wrestlers in the UFC, boasting a perfect 100% takedown defense. In this highly anticipated grudge match, can chaos 
Set an unmatchable pace and overwhelm Usman with volume as he seeks revenge for his only knockout loss? Or will the Nigerian nightmare dominate with his ever-increasing striking ability to cement his legacy as one of the greatest welterweights in UFC history? Tune into the UFC 268, Usman versus Covington, Saturday night, and let's find out.